everybody, Ann here. Just finished up my coffee and it rained this morning. It rained last night. I got quite a bit of water in the, the rain barrel situation out back. But I'm dying to find out what is growing, if anything has changed. So I'm going to grab my harvesting basket and get on out there. Let's start over here. Hmm. Yeah, looks like I got a few of these. I got to pick. Let's pick one. That one still got a ways to go. Let's see this one. Yep, that's good. All right, these are the red peppers. These are green peppers. This one's turning red, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick this. Yes. Uh. Oh no. I think I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm going to pick one of these green. One of the bigger ones, green just because I need some more green peppers. No eggplants, and none of these are big enough yet. So, look at this beautiful little tomato plant. Isn't it great? There's my beauty berry. It's growing, it's looking pretty. I love it, love it. All right, let's look at these. I pulled out all the beans. Let's look at the, what the, what the what? Oh my goodness. Yeah, I think I'll be picking that. <laughs> oh, that was easy to do. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Let's see if I got anything else. Yes, I do. I've got a weird looking round one back here. Ow, ow. Let's see. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and pick that. Uh, I don't think it's going to get any longer. Let's see what else. There's a few more little ones coming in, but nothing to get too excited over. Let's see, anything else? Yep, there's that little weird looking shaped one. I'm gonna go ahead and pick that too, because I don't think, I don't know, I think it might. I'm gonna leave that on there. And there's a few other little ones growing. You might be able to see back in there. But generally speaking, these cucumbers are not doing as good as the one down by the street. I don't know if the ant infestation had anything to do with it. Look at that lettuce. I'm going to pull that up. I think I'm going to try and plant something else there. I may end up pulling these up too and planting something else here as well. Just don't know what. All right, let's go down the street. Let's look at these cucumbers now. I bet you there's something. Oh, there is something. Look. Oh my goodness, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and pick that one. Yep, let me dust it off and put it in the basket. Oh, look at that one. I don't know. I don't know if this is going to get any bigger. Hmm, I don't know. Look at all of these. I need to steer them somewhere so they won't get too unruly. There's another one over there. I think I'm going to let those go. Yeah, I think I'm going to let those go. Let's see. Let me step on this log over here. Hmm, 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 hmm. I don't think there's any. Oh, what? Look at that. I'm going to get it. Right on. Not bad. Not bad at all. Look at this zucchini plant. I think it's done. Don't you? I don't know. I had been watering it, but I don't know if the squash bug thingy got to it or if it's just lack of water, but there is another nice one coming up right here, so hopefully I'll have some more zucchinis very, very soon. Oh yeah, there's a, there's a squash bug over there. I saw another one somewhere else. I'm going to come and take care of these later. Yeah, figures. You ugly creatures. Goodness. There's a little tomato. I think I'm going to pick it. And I may eat this. Oh, it's still got to get a little bit more ripened. But you know what? I'm going to let more of these tomatoes ripen. I've been putting them up in my window, and I think it's actually just too hot for them in that window because they ended up getting kind of like the sun bruises on them. So I'm going to let these go for a little longer. Maybe come out tomorrow and pick them. Look at these watermelons. I read that they're ready to pick if the stem gets... Well, if it gets brown, and this is not, and then the little underside is yellow, and this is not. 
So that's not ready, unfortunately. I did want to come out here and check today, though, because, whoops, I was uh, worried that with the rain, they would split. Nope, that's not ready. Let's see its underside. Oops, it's getting there. It's getting there. Maybe, maybe soon. I'm going to wait till this little stem. I hope I'm filming right. I can't see in the sun. This stem turns brown, and look, at there's another little tiny one right there. Look at that. Very cool. And there's multiple other ones. Uh, I did clip a few of these little strands coming out, but they just keep growing and growing. So far, only one spaghetti squash. This is kind of sprawled out here, but it's growing. I can't believe it. I just can't believe it. I got my paper bag, so I'm going to go across the street to Mr. Lucas and see if I can find any edible mushrooms over on his property. This is Mr. Lucas' property, and this little trail goes quite a bit back down there. I think he's got about 10 acres of land, and it's just really pretty back here. He keeps this, this little path mowed. So hopefully, pretty soon, right along this brush line, I'm going to start seeing some chanterelles. So, so pretty back here. I could like set up a tent right here and camp here forever. It's so pretty. <gasps> looky, looky. Yep, those are chanterelles. Let's see this one. That's a little small, a little broken up. Yep, that's a good one. Gonna get that one. Mm, I'm gonna let that one go. Um, I'm going to let that cluster go too, and I am going to be putting them in my paper bag. Yep, that'll keep them nice and fresh. All right, yeah, I'm going to let I'm going to let the rest of these go. Um, they're not they're really not big enough to do anything with. I'm hoping I'm going to find more. Sometimes if you look way back in the brush there, there's tons of them and they're bigger, but I got poison ivy the last time that I did that when I came out here. Oh, look, look, there's another one. Yeah, I'm going to pick that one. Absolutely, we are. Beautiful. Gosh, I should have brought my knife with me so that I could clean them up while I'm out here. That's okay. They won't take much. Oh, there's a whole bunch over there. And there's a nice, kind of big one right there. It looks like it's been here for a little while, but I'm going to go ahead and pick it. Oh, yeah, I can still clean that one up. I'm thinking, yep, I'll have to clean some of that stuff off, but I think it'll still work. We're going to get this one. I can pickle that one whole. Look at that. That's pretty. All right, we're going to take those two. Put them in my bag. And just kind of, I'll clean that off at home. Okay, what's next? Oh, all of these. Look, look it. Oh yeah, let me get this one. Yep, this one. Yep, this one. Yep, I'm gonna have enough to pickle. This one. You bet. Hmm, I think I'm gonna leave those. All right. Let me just kind of dust these off, put them in the bag, and keep looking. Oh, I'm excited. Back in here is where I found a ton of them before. There's one right there. I'm going to check that out. But all the way back in here I was getting, and I came home with a bad rash. So let me just very, very carefully get this one. Yeah, this one will be fine. There's a couple rough areas, but it'll pickle up just fine. I'm pretty much past the area where the chanterelles grow, but back in here I found that indigo blue milky and some other cool mushrooms, so I'm gonna keep walking. Just look how gorgeous it is back here. I'm so glad he keeps this mowed. And look at all of this moss. Man. All right, let's see what else we can find. Just look at it back in here. This all belongs to Mr. Lucas. It just keeps going and going and going. 
absolutely gorgeous. Not too bad, just for a morning harvesting trip. Uh, most of those are orange chanterelles. That one, I think that's a, a milky of some kind. I'm going to have to look it up to be sure. A few cayenne, a couple green peppers, and some cucumbers. Yep, I'm going to pickle those. I'm going to pickle those, and I don't know what I'm doing with the rest. Yep, I made some pickles. I can't wait to taste these. Just went to the post office, only expecting one package, but there's two. And there must have been some kind of mistake because they were getting ready to send this one back. I don't know what happened, but they're both there. They held this one for me, and so I'm going to open them. But you're going to have to wait till the next video. That's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.